Okay, welcome to the Proving Grounds. Now, we're going to cover my notes on using this application called Realterm. Uh, it's right over here. It's highlighted. And what this is used for, at least in our work environment, is to test a signal going from the pressure board sensor plate to the computer. It's similar to trying to ping a network. If you're familiar with trying to with any kind of um, networking and trying to see if you can actually connect to either a local machine on your local network or trying to connect to an outside website it's similar to that but instead of typing ping and then an IP address what we're gonna do is we are gonna select a baud rate and also a port uh, the device that we're using is using this driver or this COM port COM5 we're gonna run real term and it's not pretty but it does work. You got a bunch of different options here. The tab that we're going to be going through is port. Our port is going to be COM5. So that's confirmed. Now, we got to select our baud rate. Uh, for whatever device you're using, you should know what that is ahead of time. Otherwise, you're going to just be playing with us going back and forth. Uh, for mine, I already know what my baud rate is, which is. 921 600 and then I'm going to select change CTS got highlighted that's great now from there we want to send a ping to the sensor board and we want to get a response the way we're going to do that is we're going to send an ASCII symbol I'm going to use a capital Q and then I'm going to select send ASCII and we got a response back telling us that it's ready now if this did not happen that means that your device is not sending or it's not receiving a signal very likely it's not receiving a signal from you therefore it can't respond if it is receiving a signal and it can't respond that's a whole different set of tests but for now, that's pretty much the gist of it. If you're ever going to use this real-term serial capture program, uh, use it for your projects. I mean, not everybody uses sensors or pressure plates. You might have other devices that you might want to test out. Just do your research and have fun with it. That's all.